Hi folks, I'm Sam Haymart for Test Driven TV. In case you didn't know it, Steve Celine is back in business selling fast cars. Today we're at his factory in Corona, California taking a tour and enjoying an open house car show. Let's go take a look. The company that builds their unique brand of high-performance vehicles opens their doors every year, inviting Celine owners and fans to display their cars and stroll through the factory facilities. Celine vehicles spanning three decades were on display along with other popular muscle cars. The event is a chance for owners to meet Steve Celine and get their cars signed as well as rub elbows with other like-minded car enthusiasts. This year, well over 100 cars were in attendance from the 1980s Fox Body Mustangs all the way to Celine's newest models. Making a special appearance at the show were two new Celine Mustangs. For 2014, the 351 Extreme makes its comeback with an enlarged supercharged engine good for about 700 horsepower. The low production 351 is the most powerful and the most expensive Celine Mustang to date. Pricing starts at about $82,000 and ranges up toward $100,000 for a fully optioned convertible with custom paint like this one in the bright shade of Orange County Orange. Also pleasing the crowd was the new George Fulmer edition Celine that made its debut at Pebble Beach just a couple weeks ago. Part of the new Heritage Collection, the car celebrates legendary race car driver George Fulmer and his number 16 1969 Boss 302 race car. Its custom graphics, 19-inch Panasport style wheels, and a custom rear fascia make it visually unique. The interior gets custom leather trims in red and black with special logos throughout. This is the first production model and it's signed by Steve Celine and George Fulmer. Under the hood is a naturally aspirated 5 liter V8 with 470 horsepower. Walking around the show and taking in the sights, it's clear that the Celine brand is alive and well in the hearts of owners and enthusiasts. Mustangs of course dominated the landscape, but a number of Celine Camaro and Challenger models were represented. There were also some lesser remembered Celine vehicles like the Explorer and Focus. The highlight of the open house is of course the opportunity to take in the sparkling facilities. Steve Celine has always had a penchant for making his factory and offices a show place and his newest headquarters doesn't disappoint. The showroom and lobby is cleanly laid out with lots of displays of the company's racing heritage, product parts and of course apparel. Their famous Mustang race car from the 1990s is on display, always a favorite with its distinctive graphics. The factory itself looks more like a showroom. It has clean shiny floors, decorated walls with movie posters that Celine cars have appeared in, and generous architectural details. It's hard to believe that cars actually get built here. But build cars, they do. The process starts when new cars arrive from either Ford, Chevrolet, or Dodge. Parts like stock bumpers, wheels, and suspension are removed and replaced with Celine's high-performance products. They move to different stations for each step of the process. Some cars get a comprehensive engine transformation with the installation of a supercharger to boost horsepower using Celine's unique supercharger systems. Others will get an entirely new custom built engine such as with the 351 Extreme Mustang. Celine designed body parts including fascias, skirts and spoilers are custom painted to match and installed along with custom wheels to give the cars their distinctive look. Graphics and badges are added as well as custom interior trim to give them the finishing touch. Once completed, the new Celine Mustangs, Camaros, and Challengers head off to dealerships all around the country to become what Celine calls power in the hands of a few. Since the company was founded, Steve Celine has always offered a touch of class and exclusivity to his unique brand of vehicles and products, and as we see today, this tradition continues. Well, that wraps up our tour of the Celine factory and open house in Corona, California. I'm Sam Haymart. I hope you enjoyed the show.